poppin' ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Jelly the Baller and I'm back with another video. And today is the first day of the new year. I'm hyped. It's also the first day of the new decade. Let's go, bro. And I'm so excited to see what this year has to bring. All the stuff that's been going on in the country. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. But you guys wait, let's get right into this video. So we all know the president of the United States. <laughs> Donald Trump, right? Well, not really because he's impeached, but we all know him. We all know how the people say he's racist, people say he isn't racist, but nobody asks if I was racist. I don't believe I'm racist. I mean, I've got a few people that's telling me like, oh, bro, you would be really racist if you were white. And I don't know how I should take that, but I'm just thinking to myself, I'm not racist. I'm the most not racist person you'll ever meet. I don't talk about, my, I don't talk about black people. I don't talk about Caucasians. I don't talk about Mexicans, Filipinos, Latinos, Latinas, Chinese. Japanese? Asian? I don't do any of that. So, just to prove it to you, I have a quiz right here that I'm going to take and I'm going to show you that I'm not racist. Let's get right into it. So right here, we have the racist test. The first question, do you consider yourself pure? I mean, I know I'm not pure. I don't really believe anybody is pure. And it says, no, I am mixed race. No racial purity is a device myth. Hell yeah, I'm 100% pure. Um, I'm gonna go with the middle one. Okay, do you hate mixed race people? Me, no, I mean, I'm kind of mixed myself, so I believe everybody is equal. Steve, calm. If a person from another race was insulting your race, what would you do? I'd punch them in the face, how dare they? I just ignore them. I agree with them. I'm ashamed of my race. I am not ashamed of my race. Black don't crack. And black is powerful. I just ignore them. I mean, for real, like, if they say something about my race, I don't care. But, like, now if they say, like, the, the N word with a hard R, I punch them in the face. How dare they? Do they use racial, do you use racial slurs? Um, no. No. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, I'm kidding. Okay. Do you laugh at racist jokes? I mean, no. I've heard some pretty racist jokes. I'm not gonna disclose them on here, but like, I don't laugh at it. Racist jokes are unfunny and stupid. Racist jokes are hilarious. Most racist jokes are unfunny, but I laugh at the odd one. Oh, you know, that's kind of me, though. Like, some, most of them aren't funny because it's like, like, really, you shouldn't be laughing at it. But, like, one that's just come shooting out the dark. Okay, most, okay, yeah, I gotta go with that. Are you proud of your race? Very proud. I love being black, man. Black don't crack. Have you ever had a crush on a girl slash boy of a different race? Or do you already have a crush on one? I mean, um, whoa, no, that's disgusting. That would be treason against your race. Jeez. Um, yeah, no, I have had a crush on somebody who is part of a different race. So, yes. Do you listen to RAC music, Rock Against Communism? Um, never heard of it. Never heard of it. Do you have friends of a different race? Oh, yeah. Like, I have friends that are like, like, like all over the world, different kinds of races. Okay, which is least the, well, which of these leaders do you support most? Mahatma Gandhi, I know who that is. Barack Obama, come on, man. Barack Obama all the way. All right, let's see my test results. Okay. 
for sure 40 percent you are not racist you believe people are equal it's good to know there are people like you in the world please spread your message far and wide because the world needs it right now 55 percent of 100,231 quiz participants had this profile profile a you could also get this result for 30 percent you are very racist oh god you hate people who are not of your ra I did not say that! Did I say that? I feel sad for you. Deep down, you must be very insecure and maybe you're a narcissistic sociopath. God help you. Fam. I don't hate- what? <laughs> I don't hate people who are not in my race. I didn't even say that. They assumed that. Or even this one. For 30%, you are not racist. Okay. Calm. You believe people are equal. It's good to know. Okay, yeah, okay, I read that. Fam, like, I'm not racist, though. Like, chill. You can, okay. Uh, the 40%, the 30%, that's kind of close. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to take another one. Because this one just threw off my whole psyche. So, I'm gonna get back to y'all when I find another one. Okay, we have found another one. Do you think you are racist? Oh, um, that's an easy question. No, you're not racist. Calm. Is the first thing you notice when a person enters a room their color slash race? Um, I mean, only like if like somebody is walking, like if they're like black or white, then I'm automatically gonna know who they are. But if they walk in with like tan skin and then some really crazy hair that I'm gonna you know I'm gonna wonder like hey what race are you like where are you from hey, sometimes yeah sometimes are there specific races that you do not like of course not bro I love all races we're all equal no do you make racist remarks slash comments um jokingly yeah jokingly only if I'm joking and they, the people I'm around know I'm joking. I don't do it like to offend anybody. Do you know or have any friends who are of a different race than yourself? Well, well, there are a few that are not my friends, but classmates slash office mates. Um, no, yeah, I have a whole bunch of friends that are of a different race. So yeah, of course. What is your first reaction when seeing Caucasian women with an African American child? Oh, he's so cute. He's like, she is so cute. Good for them. <laughs> the child is probably adopted. <laughs> Yo, fam, that's not funny. Um, he's so trashy. <laughs> Hell, that is terrible. Um, that child is probably adopted. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, like. If I see a white woman with a dark chocolate child, I'm gonna be here adopted. You feel me? So, that child is probably adopted. I'm just saying. What is your opinion on interrelational relationships? That's cool, it is normal, it is different, it is weird, it is wrong. Um, well, it's normal. Like, to me, it's normal. Like, I don't care. I see a whole bunch of interrelation into racial relationships at my school. Um, in public, I mean, it's not really, there's really nothing you can do about it. There's a whole bunch on YouTube, so there's really nothing you can do about it. You just gotta accept it. So, yeah, it's normal. I like it. Okay, last question. Do you refuse to participate in other culture other than yours? Food, music, activities, holidays, fashion. I mean, black people really don't, I mean, we have culture, but, like, we don't really have, like, a holiday or anything. We just celebrate the holidays that regular Americans celebrate Christmas, New Year's, 4th of July. We don't really have our own holiday, but we do have our own month. Yeah, Black History Month, February, next month. Um, but no, I love, like, to celebrate other, um, activities, like, other cultures' activities, like, um, you guys know what Day of the Dead is in Mexico? Um, I haven't celebrated it, but I've seen a lot about it, and it's honestly, like, cool. Like, I love to celebrate that one day. It's it's pretty tight. Um, yes. Yeah, I'd love to try it. You got it. You are not racist.
Congratulations, you are not racist. You are behaving like friends and family members with a stranger, and you prove that you are a gentleman. Ladies and gentlemen, your boy is not racist. I kept trying to tell other people that I'm not racist, but they, they don't want to believe me. So, um, yeah. Screw you if you think I'm racist. But, that's going to end this video off here. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I told you I'm going to be dropping some bangers for y'all all year. All decade. All of this YouTube career thing. But, you already know, y'all. Like, comment, subscribe. And should I drop a school video? Because I'm going to be going to school next Tuesday. So let me know if I should drop a school video next week. Or if I should just wait till like, everything cools down and then drop a school video. Because I'm thinking about doing that. Because I don't want to like walk up there on the first day like, Hey, y'all, what's good? Like, no, I don't want to do that. Because like people are going to be annoyed because school is back. And just basically all that jazz. But maybe I'm going to do one probably Thursday or when everybody's cooled down. So, like I always say, I'll catch y'all in the next video. 10,000 subs on the way.